Hi YouTubers, it's me Leslie and this is going to be a video on me um, getting ready to wash um, my weave, my, oh uh, uh, my gosh, my uh, full sew in and my scalp and I'm going to be shampooing it, conditioning it and then leaving it under a cap for about 15 minutes and then I'm going to let it uh, air dry but I think I might braid it up pretty good so I kind of wanted to show you guys what I'm going to do first the sink is right here so I'm going to use lukewarm water to wet my whole hair and then I'm going to go through with the applicator bottle this is the shampoo so you pick a certain type of shampoo and you just use this to apply throughout your tracks so make sure you part it throughout so you can be able to do that. This is the shampoo one, and you only put it, I don't even think you guys can see it. There's one ounce and two ounce, so you're gonna put one ounce, there's one ounce right here, and you're gonna put water right about there, and then right up to two ounces, that's where you're gonna put the shampoo up to. So once it hits two ounces, then you're good. So with the conditioner, here's mine. Make sure you shake it. Same thing, one ounce of conditioner. And then you're gonna put more than, you're gonna go past the two ounce line because you're gonna want more uh, conditioner on it and this is what you're gonna leave on. So I wanted to kind of show you guys uh, what I'm gonna be putting on it. So I'm gonna be putting, this is the shampoo I'm using. It's my Mane and Tail and Body Shampoo. Love it, I love it on my own hair. And I also used that on this hair before I installed it. So it actually worked great. Okay, and then my olive oil replenishing conditioner. Love that stuff too. And then I also have like right afterwards, um, after it's all washed and stuff, I'm going to oil up my scalp and everything. But I make sure I only put just a little bit of oil because you don't want the oil too much oil to be on your uh, hair. So, I'm going to, right now, I'm going to just wet my hair. So, just bear with me. So, I will show you guys what it looks like right after I just wet it. And then I'll show you guys how I put the shampoo on and massage it and then condition and then massage it. Okay, I'm back. As you guys can see, my hair is wet, so I just put water on it. I put water on my scalp and everything. So, and you guys can see how it's kind of uh, curling up. That's what the hair usually does. It's like a Brazilian natural wave to it. So, I'm going to, let me see, where's my hair tie? Okay, I'm going to tie this up right here. I'm going to show you guys how I do the shampoo part. Okay, so as you guys can see, there, you can see my hair right here. So what you're going to do is you're going to tilt your head back and keep your head back too. Because it's going to let the uh, shampoo go down through the rest of your scalp. Okay. And then you're going to softly massage it just to kind of clean it. Just to break up the dirt. You don't want to do it too hard because it will end up um, loosening your braids up too much. So same thing right in here with the shampoo, okay, so massage it in again, massage, 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 don't know if you guys can see it, but it's getting kind of, it's getting clean, okay, and then, so you're just going to go through every single um track and make sure see my thing I got a closure up here 
so I have to go basically at the go in there because okay so we're gonna massage that as well massage 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 okay so I'm gonna go right on the bottom right underneath Okay, same thing. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Scrub, scrub, scrub. And I will repeat. I will rinse this out and then I'll show you guys how I put the conditioner in after I rinse it. So I'll be back. Hey, YouTubers, again. Okay, here's the conditioner. So I'm going to do the same thing. Tilt my head back. And this I'm going to actually leave on. So, I'm just trying to stick it all on there. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna massage that in. And I'm gonna leave this on for a few minutes. Just so Okay, and when I come back, I'm going to be rinsing this out, and then I'm going to be doing this part, and, okay. Hey, YouTubers, it's me. Okay, I already shampooed this, and I just put in the conditioner, so I'm just waiting a little bit before I rinse it out, and then I'm going to put in some sprays. Sorry. Then I'm going to put in some sprays. Um, I think I'm going to put in my, um, Hawaiian Silky, and then I'm going to switch through with my daily leave-in tonic as well, but, um, yeah, so once I rinse this out, then I'll show you, I'll show you what me Spraying this in, and then after that, I'm going to go and put that oil on my scalp. So stay tuned. 
Hi YouTubers, as you guys can tell, I am in the bathroom. So I rinsed out I rinsed out the um the conditioner. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put the oil in first, and then I'll spray the detangler in, and then what I'm gonna probably do is put it in a protective style, like some type of braid or something so it can dry overnight. So when you're putting the oil on, make sure, so what I'm going to do is, I don't know if you guys can see, but, um, let's see, okay, so what I'm going to do, you only put a little drops of this, there is extra virgin olive oil in here, and coconut oil, and almond oil, and jojoba oil, and black Jamaican castor oil, the whole thing. So all you're going to do is just stick just a tiny little drop in there, that's all you do. Just tiny little drop. Don't put too much on there. See, like, there's... Ah, oh, crap. Sorry. See, there's, like, way too much right here. And you see how that bald spot... We're going to get that to grow. So I'm just kind of working that in because I just don't want it to end up uh, sliding. So, there we go. And you guys see this, this bald spot's growing in, which is great. And I've only had this in for about nine days. <laughs> and I have been taking the Hairfinity pills. I haven't had really any side effects, really. So, we won't really see the growth until after I take out the sew-in. Okay, so I did that section. <coughs> and then you're going to go up here and do all this. Just make sure you get all of this. And then, there we go. Just make sure you guys work that in. I'm working it in. Because I just don't want the stuff on my hair. That's all I need. Okay. And there's that. And then by the closure. So. There's like pieces in here. So. So how I had braided my hair, I didn't braid it in a circular motion. So I have to make sure that I'm going through everything and getting it because I didn't braid it in a circular motion because I don't know how to do it in a circular motion. So you just make sure Okay, I got that side done. So now we're going to finish this side. Get this all done. It might be come a little oily, but eh. oh well. It's kind of hard to avoid getting oil, you know getting oil on your hair and not under, you know, it's very hard. And then, what I'm going to do is make sure that I go around here and then I'm going to tilt my head down and I'm going to make sure that I get the hairs down here. And Gonna massage that in as well. Okay. And I'm gonna grab my Hawaiian Silky and it doesn't really spray out, so 
I'm just gonna work it in. It's like, ow. It like sprays on your hand. Let's see. Sorry I'm not talking. I'm just trying to get it all on this hair. So all of it can be nice, not just pieces of it. Let me take this thing off because it's kind of messing me up. Okay. There we go. Okay. So we're going to put my hair back how it should be. Okay. So, we're going to comb this out, let's see, let me move this over, so we're going to comb this, get that, I'm going to use this comb first, I'm going to comb through that first, then we're going to make sure we got through all of this. And then I'm gonna comb through all of this as well. Um, that piece can go right there. Gotta make sure this closure is on correctly. So just want to make sure this is all untangled. not untangled yet. There we go. Sorry I'm not talking. Just trying to really concentrate. Okay, I just want to make sure all the tangling is done so I can braid it. What is, why is there a clump of hair right there? Okay, so that goes right there, that goes right there, that goes right there. Okay, I don't know if you guys can tell. I don't know how it looks in the back, but I just wanna make sure this is all um, detangled before I braid it up. There we go. Okay. And now I'm just gonna use the brush. Just, just to double check. Sorry. Just double check and make sure. that down there we go okay and I'm just gonna braid this all up and you guys comment subscribe and God bless and have a good day and night bye